guess what, kids? It's been a whole year since I received my San Diego Zacti camera. Oh, yeah. In that time, I've definitely made a lot of videos. A lot of them bad, uh, a couple of them good, or at least somewhat tolerable. I know some of you are wondering, you know, what I plan to do for uh, my vlogging in the future. And I have uh, two definite plans set out. The first one is to get a new camera. The thing is, since I've been vlogging for about a year now, I think that it's, you know, about high time I get myself a new setup. And I'll definitely keep this camera around as like a backup, just because I don't think it would do well on eBay because the uh, tripod mount is stripped. Some people might not like that. Me, I found ways to get around it by putting it in different little setups. Like uh, a lot of times I set it up in like a bowl or something, so it's all propped up. I'll have to show you guys that sometime. Yeah, I want to get myself a new camera, and uh, the camera that I have my eye on right now is the uh, the new Sanyo Zacti. So, um, won't be leaving the, the uh, Sanyo family at all. Um, the one I'm going to be getting is, uh, if I remember the, uh, the lettering right, um, it's the Sanyo Zacti TH6, or THD6, I can't quite remember. Um, it's basically the traditional camcorder setup. Not that I have anything against the, uh, the pistol style setup that Sanyo Zacti is famous for. It's just that it definitely has a lot of limitations. Like, uh, for instance, if I wanted to sit it down without a tripod or anything like that, it would lay like this. So, <laughs> or it'd be all like cockeyed and crooked like this. Uh, I definitely can't have that. But it is great for, you know, just vlogging or getting a good close up on my face. <laughs> but other than that, it, it's very limited and it's, uh, functionality so I wanted to get the traditional style even though it's uh, a bit bigger than this a bit heftier to put in my pocket and that sort of thing but I like it because you can sit it down without the use of a tripod and uh, just record something like there's a lot of times when you know when, when I was living in BG that I went to Guitar Center and uh, I, could, I wanted to record something but I really couldn't just uh, not just because of noise or whatever but because I couldn't set up the camera correctly because you know, the tripod mount is stripped, and I can't, you know, shove a little tripod in there and just set it up. And because of the camera's design, I couldn't just prop it up or anything like that. And uh, if I had a bit of more traditional styled setup, then that wouldn't have been a problem. Yeah, like I said, I'm going to be getting the San Diego Zacti TH or THD6. Um, it's the traditional style setup. And, it, of course, it's going to be in blue, because blue is my favorite color. Those run generally around uh, from 200 to 230. I've seen some of them go as high as a uh, 250, but you get a bunch of extras if you pay that much, like like a memory card, uh, a case, maybe an extra battery or something. So um, it's generally not considered a bad deal or anything. Yeah, they have a, a waterproof version of that too. I'm not going to be getting that. It'd be kind of nice to have it just for like the novelty, but if I would get a waterproof camcorder, I'll probably just get one of the older San Zacti ones. The second part of my uh, vlogging plans are to uh, do something similar to what uh, Charles Trippi and Shay Carl are doing. I know a couple other uh, YouTube vloggers are doing the same thing too, but those are the two ones that uh, come to mind. Basically what I'm going to try to do is uh, vlog every, uh, once a day every day, um, starting from my birthday, which is uh, December 7th, to the following birthday. So it would be from December 7th, 2009 to December 7th, 2010. Just as kind of an experiment. I know it's a bit of a long-term experiment, but I think it will be uh, kind of interesting to see, you know, what comes of it. And uh, definitely a lot of interesting things have come from just me vlogging sporadically. But yeah, I want to do it like a daily vlog. And mine won't be quite as long as Charles Trippy's unless I'm doing something really you know, spectacular or special or something. Yeah, originally I was kind of against the idea just because I thought, you know, well, my life's not really that interesting and there's not really a whole lot that I can do around here. I mean, at least with Charles, you know, he's in Florida and he can visit all the cool stores and visit all the nice places and he's got money to travel around if he wants to. Um, I don't know where he gets it, but whatever. And uh, I don't quite have that kind of money. I mean, the most I get from the internet is just a uh, little over 30 bucks a month, which uh, is definitely not bad. I'm not, not complaining about that at all. I'm just saying it's not really considered a uh, an adequate traveling budget, because I think the most I would get would be like a full tank of gas and maybe a, a meal or two, or just like a couple Milky Ways or something. Um, so what I would like for you guys to do would be to uh, visit the donation page on the com, and I know I hate sounding like, you know, an internet beggar. You know, I really want to uh, travel and do a lot of vlogging about traveling. It would be really uh, 
beneficial if I would be able to collect some donations just because I don't really have an income at this time. And I did apply for unemployment, but I haven't really gotten anything yet. And when I do, unemployment's not really going to be that much. But what I want to do for my daily vlogging would be to, you know, travel. I don't necessarily have to go very far, just out of Salina, I guess. Visit different shops, uh, different landmarks, that sort of thing, and just vlog there. And, you know, I'd really like to do a traveling vlog. Just that way you guys, you don't have the means to, you know, go out there and see parts of the world for whatever reason. You know, I'd like to be able to give you guys a window into that so you can see what's out there. It definitely won't be in super duper high definition or anything like that, which I think is good because then you'll be able to get to see the real whatever, not through a bunch of, you know, glossed over lenses and things like that. I think that's really good. But yeah, uh, those are my uh, two basic plans for uh, my uh, future vlogging would be to get a new camera, which would be the Sanus Act TH or THD uh, 6, which is a traditional style camcorder in blue, of course, and also uh, doing a daily vlog. And uh, uh, kind of the third thing would be to uh, be able to travel while I'm vlogging. That kind of goes a, a bit hand in hand with my daily vlogging. We'd get, you know, money to travel around, visit different places, that sort of thing. I'm going to try to get this vlog up as uh, soon as I can, but because my stepdad may or may not be here soon, I don't really know how it's going to go. So I'm going to try to edit it as quick as I can and uh, upload it as quick as I can. So um, this is Andy San signing off for now. Thanking you guys for uh, all of your comments and all of your views. Here's one year down, and here's to many more. See ya.